It's the only appropriate sentence for such an abhorrent crime, which had abuse of power at its core. But it doesn't bring her back. It, no life sentence would have been enough. Like, her family's tragedy doesn't end today. You know, like, we would have been outraged had it not been a life sentence. But fundamentally, like, it was preventable. And it's unfathomable that Cressida Dick stays in her position. This is insane and calls him a wrong and like the dismissiveness at the core of that is why it's rotten. Like that that you would just make that comment at the Women's Institute about being a wrong and just be like, oh yeah, there's some bad apples. It's not a bad apple. You, this man did this and he was one of yours and now they're trying to do spin and be like a former police officer. He was a serving police officer who used a warrant card to, to arrest her. And the predatory behavior is the whole thing. That's the common thread. They're like picking us off like we're big game. It's terrifying. Like, to have those two cases intersect this morning in the Old Bailey, it's terrifying. And no one, no one cares enough to make it a fundamental priority and difference. Like, everyone I've spoken to for the last two days, like, has just been in bits. It's, it's you and me, you know?